There is a second type of conditional expected value, and this is the notation that is used, the expected value of x given y. There is a subtle difference here between the following. The expected value of x given y equals little y, and that's what we've seen on the previous two examples, versus this new notation, which is the expected value of x given y. As a particular instance, let's look at the expected value of x given y equals y on the previous page. If you were to work that out for any little y value right here, you would get 10 minus y divided by 2. Now in the previous example, little y happened to be 2. So we got 10 minus 2, which is 8 divided by 2 or 4. But the key here is, is this thing right here, this expected value, is a constant. It is not a random variable. This one right here is a random variable. If we were to look to the previous uh, page and calculate the expected value of x given y, in this case, we would not put in the value little y. We would leave it as an uppercase y. And we would have 10 minus uppercase y divided by 2. The key here is, is this is a random variable as opposed to a constant. So here is an example with the expected value of x given y. Let x and y be continuous random variables with support on the unit square with opposite corners at 0, 0, and 1, 1. So here is a picture of that particular support. Here's script A, unit square. Now, you have no idea what the joint probability density function is over that unit square. You just know that that's where the random variables are defined. And what we want to find here is we want to find the variance of the variance of the expected value of x given y. This looks like alphabet soup, but the way to unwind this thing is to start from the center. From the discussion over here, the expected value of x given y is a random variable. When you go one layer deeper and say, what is the variance of a random variable? Well, the variance of a random variable is a constant. And finally, when you come out one more level, what is the variance of some constant? Well, the variance of a constant is 0. So the answer to this question is the variance of the variance of the expected value of x given y is 0.